right what's up YouTube it's Ian I haven't made a video in a while figured I'd uh, do one real quick while I'm running an errand so as you can see I have the uh, CBR 600 back from the shop Um, so I had a couple things done to it. Uh, I had a new rear tire put on. Had because the one that was on there was a touring kind of weird flat profile tire that made the bike not want to lean over. closing the vents in my helmet so hopefully the sound will be a little better my dead cats have fallen off so there's a lot of wind that's why but uh so they got rid of that flat rear tire that made the bike not want to turn and put a nice Dunlop for me uh, they took the carbs off and balanced balanced the carbs, cleaned them. Ooh. And uh, replaced what they called vacuum plugs, I believe, on the carburetor. They said they were all dry rotted. Um, they put my uh, those radiator hoses or uh, air air box hoses that I had um, on the air box assembly where they should go. Um, they fixed my turn signal switch, kind of. It still feels like crap, but they didn't charge me for that. Um, they fixed the throttle linkage and. Adjusted the clutch. Um, so she's running real good. Um, the main problem, remember if, uh, from the other videos, I had the idle kind of moving around and uh, they said that was due to the, car the carbs being out of bounds. And uh, they just needed to rebalance them, which is not surprising. Um, let's see, I know I'm forgetting something that they did. I think that's about it. Um, that's all the important stuff anyway. Oh, they uh, hooked up the choke for me. Because uh, the choke wasn't, the choke linkage wasn't hooked to the carb. The actual bracket that goes on the carbs for the chokes was missing. Joke works. Fast as shit. I love this bike now. They adjusted the clutch. They just did a bunch of stuff and it, it just feels way better. Bike feels happy. The only issues 
Um, oh, they installed the front fender for me because that was a pain in the ass and I didn't want to do it. Um, the only issue is that the front tire is rubbing on the front fender. And so the solution, the easiest solution to that is going to be to uh, to just get a smaller front tire. Dumb as that sounds. That's the easiest fix. So, uh, anyway, that's about it. I gotta go to the ATM here and I don't want y'all to see. So, uh, I'm gonna come back with a better video about this bike here shortly. Talk to you guys later. Ride safe.